We'd like to thank Owen Heritage and the Floyd County Library for asking us to do this recital. My name is Jessica Dorman. You may have heard me on past First Friday recitals. Um, I believe it was last fall that I sang a recital with Owen, and this past May uh, I submitted a video recital where I played solo piano. Um, in case you missed either of those, I am an adjunct piano and voice instructor at Indiana University Southeast. Um, I also run a private piano and voice studio out of my home. Um, I also freelance around town, and I'm a staff accompanist at the University of Louisville, where I play for mostly singers and brass players. So this is my husband, Colin Dorman, and I'm going to let him introduce himself. Like Jessica said, my name is Colin Dorman. Uh, I also am an adjunct instructor of French horn at Indiana University Southeast. Uh, I teach community members uh, in the Arts Institute there. I also have a private studio uh, at SWK Music Studios located here in Louisville. I'm a member of Small Batch Brass, a New Orleans style brass band, uh, as well as Fourth Horn of the Huntington Symphony Orchestra, and I, I also freelance around town. Um, we decided to put together a short program featuring a wide range of styles and sounds of French horn and piano. We're starting off with a piece called En Ferre by Eugene Boza, written in 1941 as a, a competition entry. This shows uh, all manner of, of horn kind of sounds. Uh, we have high, low, fast, slow, we have some stopped horn, we have some muted horn, we have uh, glissandos that are going to kind of sound like elephant calls. Um, it just go, goes all over the place. Uh, so please enjoy En Ferret. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
popular songs for Frank Sinatra, Tony Bennett, uh, similar artists like that. Um, but he also wrote music for classical instrumentation and classical instruments, but in a more jazzy and, and popular tune kind of style. Uh, this pe these two movements are pu pulled from a selection called Suite for Horn and Piano, which has five movements. We're going to do two movements, Slow and Sweet and Song. Please enjoy Alec Wilder's Suite for Horn and Piano.
the final two pieces we have for you today are both from a Sonata for Horn and Piano by Josef Reinberger. Reinberger was a composer who lived during the uh, late Romantic era. Uh, he had kind of an interesting th start, though. Apparently, he really wanted to be a musician. His father did not. So he went out and became the church organist at the age of seven. So after, after you get a gig, I guess it's okay to, to become a musician. His father kind of gave him his blessing and, and let him pursue his, his uh, passion. He wrote a lot of pieces. Uh, he was very prolific, masses, symphonies, uh, operas, and dozens of work for French uh, for organ. Um, this piece for horn and piano is one of the, the few romantic sonatas we have for horn and piano, and it's really a, a beautiful work. We're going to be playing the second and third movements. The second movement is quasi adagio, and the third movement is con fuoco. Thank you very much.
Heritage and the Floyd County Library.